Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. It is time for another renovation reveal. This one is for my loft space and my very first apartment. If you can't already tell, I got a camera. Every video that I have posted on this channel so far has been filmed on my iPhone, so I am stepping it up in the world. <laughs> and also really exciting news, because I now have a camera that speeds up the whole process of uploading footage and because I'm getting a little bit more comfortable with editing, I can now announce that I'm going to start posting weekly on this channel, which is something that I've always wanted but just have physically been not able to make it happen. Um, I'm going to post every Sunday, or at least try to. I'll let you know if something goes wrong, but I'm going to try to post every single Sunday. I have a video coming up next week that is cat themed. I haven't been able to in the past because I spend so much time on TikTok um, and it's just impossible with all of the different roadblocks that I've had, but now I have the supplies that I need, so I want to keep this video really short and sweet, so if you want to see any in-depth details about any of the DIY projects or specifics about this renovation, you can check out my Instagram or my TikTok because I posted the full series on both apps, so if you don't have one or the other, you can still see it. I am going to give the most brief overview ever, um, just in case anyone watching this has not seen the series or has no idea what's going on right now. Basically, this is my first apartment and before I even get started, one of the most frequently asked questions that I get is, am I allowed to paint and drill and do all of that in my apartment? And the answer is yes, I would not be doing any of this if I wasn't allowed to and then also posting it online to get myself in trouble. When I was apartment searching, something that I looked into was if I could paint or make holes or all of those things, just because this is my job. I do DIYs, I make content, I design things, so I definitely wanted to have that flexibility. But basically, I have this miniature loft space in my apartment that you can barely stand up in. It's kind of really short and small, but I wanted to do something really fun with it. I wanted to activate the space and make it into something that I would actually use. So I thought about different options. I asked my followers what they would be interested in, and I ended up leaning towards a library. And I don't have that many books because I just moved out of my parents' house, so I couldn't make an entire library. So I decided to make it library mixed with a reading nook, mixed with a guest room if I can ever have guests over at any point ever. Just a brief overview of what we did with this project. We added a mattress that we already had to act as a reading nook. We also added some cube storage in a corner so that we could put all of our books or other knickknacks in there. Then I actually added a faux brick wall to the entire side of the loft all the way down to my kitchen because I really wanted it to feel like a loft and I feel like it highlights the architecture really well. Then I painted the area around the bed black to make it a lot more cozy and I added a whole bunch of wood pieces to create this almost built-in structure throughout the whole perimeter of the space. Lastly, I just added all sorts of different fun colorful decorations to make it vibrant and urban and just everything I've ever wanted in a space. That is the really, really, really basic overview. So without further ado, let's get into the B-roll and see the before and after of this space.
guys loved this project as much as I do. It's so exciting to be able to show a little bit more of my style to you guys because this is not like anything that I've shown previously on TikTok or YouTube or Instagram. Again, if you want the in-depth information about any of this, you can check out my Instagram and my TikTok. If you have any product specific questions, of where to get something or you want to buy something, comment down below and I'll try to respond to as many comments as possible. If you have made it to the end of this video, thank you. I love you so much and I will see you guys all next Sunday for my next video. Bye guys.